start this afternoon with a helicopter rescue attempt in what was a deadly incident at the border. A man died and a woman was rescued today after they were found in the water. And Fox 5's Misha DeBono starts us off live at Borderfield State Park with what we're learning so far. Misha. Yeah, Andrew, good afternoon. The woman was apparently stuck on the border fence behind me here over the water. They didn't know about this male victim at all until she told them his body washed ashore about three, 300 yards just north of me here in Imperial Beach. Now, Sky Fox was over the scene this morning when it all played out. The male victim was washed ashore in Imperial Beach on the U.S. side of the fence. Lifeguards performed life-saving measures, but they could not revive him. The woman was rescued from the actual border fence dangerously over the ocean. Tijuana lifeguards were able to rescue her, brought her to shore on the U.S. side here. Imperial Beach lifeguards then had to use a watercraft to get to this area. It's very remote, hard to get to. They got here fairly quickly, but again, sadly, they could not save the man. We've had uh, several of these rescues where people get stuck on the fence, uh, border fence here. And uh, as far as I'm aware, this is uh, one of the first that we've had where they're stuck on the border fence where as it dips into the Pacific Ocean. You can see behind me the waves are pretty high today, and uh, that just causes an extra element of danger. You know, it, it takes uh, partnerships and help from different agencies to be able to, at the very least, save the female's life. Unfortunately, we do, did lose uh, the male victim today. And this really was a massive response. There was about 25 vehicles down here, helicopter overhead. Neither victim has been identified so far, but you might recall uh, last October, a woman died along with 13 people rescued, 70 people though in the water trying to swim from Mexico into the United States. We'll continue to follow this and bring you more details as we learn them. For now though, we are live in Imperial Beach. Misha DeBono, Fox 5 News. All right, Misha, starting us off, thank you.